Hi Andrew. Yeah, um, it was in year seven that um, they gave us a they gave us a Bible, a New Testament. Um, the Gideon Society gave us New Testament in year seven at the Knox School. It was then called uh, Knoxfield College, and many of my friends um, were defacing them or burning them. And I thought, well, I don't believe and I'm tending towards not believing it. But I wanted to read it and then I'd have a good reason to reject it. So I thought, um, and I started reading from the Gospel of Matthew. And then as I was reading Jesus' words, Yeshua's words, um, I just thought this stuff is easier to believe than disbelieve. This guy seems to know what he's talking about. Um, the ways he's teaching us to live are good and right, faithful and honest. And I thought life would be better if more people believed it and lived this way. And no, but you're right that that um, there's not. We don't see equality in this life, and we don't see all people being treated equally in different places. We're a very blessed nation. It seems wherever this gospel's gone, there's been there's been blessing, not because people deserve it, um, not because they deserve it more than others, but maybe God is glorifying his um, his message. Um, but yeah, we, we it teaches us also that we're only seeing part of their story, each person's story. Um, it teaches us that there's life. After death, there's going to be a resurrection and a judgment. And for us in, in wealthy places who have ample access to the gospel and um, like uh, so much before us, so much information, we can seek the truth and find it or we can ignore it. Um, and yeah, it would be really sad for us at the end of the day if we haven't sought the truth and found it um, because we've been given every opportunity Whereas people in, in less privileged places, um, they might never have an opportunity to seek the truth about these things. So I, I imagine that the judgment will be not so harsh for them as it will be for, for us if we're not obedient to it. Yeah. Now Jesus said something like that. He said, those who did not know their master's will and did not prepare themselves to do it, will be beaten with few beatings, but those who knew their master's will and did not prepare themselves to do it will be beaten with many beatings. And so it seems that that God has everything covered um, and has an answer for everything. And yeah, I appreciate that. I've learned so much over the years. I'm learning more and more about Yeshua's teaching, about the teaching of the Bible. Uh, the teaching of God, and as I grow in, I, it just seems to prove itself right over and over again for me. Yeah, that's me.